We're now talking to Chet Fuller at the Farnborough Air Show. Firstly, congratulations on the latest news of the Air Baltic order. Thanks. Is this the first time that C-Series has competed head-on with the MAX and the NEO? I think it's probably the first time that we've had a competition where the MAX 7 was defined enough to have an actual competition. Uh, so this competition at Baltic was between the 319 NEO, the 7 MAX, and uh, the CS300. So, uh, so uh, uh, within one, one definition, absolutely, I think this is probably the first true small airplane, uh, small narrowbody uh, competition. So Bombardier must feel pretty confident that uh, C-Series can take on MAX and NEO and win? Is that the oh, absolutely. Failure? You know, I think uh, it, it's just it's just basic economics. Uh, the airplane is much lighter than both the other airplanes. The airplane has a dramatically bigger fan diameter than both the other airplanes, um, and the airplane is an all-new material system. So aluminum, lithium, and composites. Both the other airplanes are basically aluminum airplanes, and that means you still have your five-year D checks as opposed to a twelve-year D check on a C series. So the maintenance cost all gets driven by uh, the material system and modern technology in the systems. The uh, the the weight is a, is delivered by the modern material system as well as modern uh, uh, construction techniques, and that delivers the economics. So obviously this is only the first first one-on-one -on -one competition, but uh, you feel a bit more confident going forward. Absolutely. I mean we've we've had a we've had a very good year with customers. We feel like we're going to have a, a continue to have a good year with the customers. Um, the, uh, you know, the, uh, the, the, the doubt and the haters are becoming fewer and fewer and, uh, and now we're starting to see the, the, the real interest in becoming a part of the early years of the order book, which is a great concern to a lot of customers. Thanks so much. You're welcome.